Hi there, this is Love Johar. Thank you so much for watching this channel and thank you so much for tuning into this video. Today, we will understand a very important concept, which is of certificates. Now, why do we need certificates? First of all, you should understand that. What is the importance of certificates? What are the different types of certificates? And why as a cyber security professional, you should know about each type of certificates in detail. All this will be covered in this video and the upcoming videos. So in this video, we will start from the basics. What is a domain certificate? So a domain certificate is nothing but a digital certificate, which is used to secure your website. Okay. You can also call it SSL certificate. You can also call it TLS certificate. Now, why you use this certificate? is because domain certificates use encryption. Now, why do you need encryption on a website? You need encryption on a website in order to protect your data that is transmitted between your website and the visitor's browser, the client browser. So if you have encryption, if you have domain certificates, then it, it helps to prevent the unauthorized access to the sensitive information. For example, your credit card numbers, your passwords, etc. Now, when we talk about domain certificates, there are three different types of domain certificates. One is known as domain validated. The other is known as organization validated. And the third one is known as extended validation certificates. So what is the difference between these three? Quickly. So domain validated certificates are very easy to obtain and are relatively inexpensive when you try to purchase them. Because here, you only have to provide your authority that you, that you own a website. You are the owner of a website. That's it. And you would be allotted a certificate for domain validated certificates. However, if you go for organization validated OV certificates, so the previous one is called DV, domain validated. This one is called OV, organization validated. When you go for organization validated certificates, here you have to provide some more information. So here you have to provide your organization details, your name, your address, your phone number, etc. And after that, the most secure type of domain certificate, if anybody can ask you in the interview, like, you know, what are the different types of certificates, which one is the most secure, is EV, which is Extended Validation Certificate. And why it is the most secure? Because here, the website owner himself has to provide a lot of extensive information about the organization, about the address, the legal name, phone number, registration number, etc. So extended validation certificates also display the organization name in the address bar of the visitor's browser. If you ever go to a website, just try to see this. So this extended validation certificate also gives confidence to the clients that this particular website is legitimate. So now the question should be, how should one get a domain certificate? In order to get a domain certificate, you will need to purchase the certificate from a certificate authority. Certificate authority are different certificate authorities are there. You can choose between them. You can compare the pricing for whichever certificate authority suits you best, and you can make a decision accordingly. But for a domain certificate, you have to purchase it. I will make sure you understand this point because in the other type of certificate, when we will learn about self-signed certificates, there you will understand this point better. So for domain certificates, you have to purchase them from a certificate authority. Just remember that. So here, once you purchase a certificate, then you have to install it on your website, your web server. Now the installation process will vary depending upon which web servers you have, you know, whether they are hosted on Linux, Windows, etc. So that will vary. I don't want to cover that technical aspects here because here we are trying to understand the essential part of domain certificates. So here, as you must have seen so far, domain certificates are an essential part of your website security. Because if you want to make sure that your user's data, uh, which whatever data is there, is secure, so then you have to make sure that you have domain certificates as part of your website. And this will make sure that you have increased website traffic because, again, people will make sure that this is a genuine website. And this will improve your Google search ranking as well if you have certificates installed on your website. And it will also enhance your uh, risk. It, it will also reduce the risk of data breach because 
this will as i already mentioned protect the visitors data from any unauthorized access because all the data is encrypted okay so this is a very short video on domain certificates if you have any questions any follow up questions on this or if you want any more information in terms of what exactly do you need uh, to to install domain certificates or what are the different examples of domain certificates feel free to add the in the comment section i would be more than happy to respond back thank you so much for watching take care bye bye